everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very exciting piece of news for you. I, Swilly, have been appointed as the new GM of the Angels. Thank you, please. No applause needed. I have decided to press pause on my life in order to become the new GM of the Angels and bring this team back to its former glory. Okay, not really, but I will be doing that in Out of the Park Baseball. This is gonna be a multi-part series. I'm super excited about it. I saw Foolish Bailey playing this game and it looked incredibly fun. If you don't know who Foolish Bailey is, AKA Foolish Baseball, do you even immerse yourself in baseball content? I've put his information down below so you can check him out. He makes incredible baseball content. He's a stat nerd like I am. I love his stuff. Mr. Arturo Moreno gave me a call and said, Swilly, listen, you're the best Twitter GM we got. I see your tweets. I know you're frustrated. So am I. I want you to take over because Perry is just not getting it done. And I said, okay. If you liked today's video, feel free to leave a like on it. Only if you liked it though. And let me know down below how you feel about the game, how you feel about the moves that we're gonna make. It's gonna be a fun and exciting series. I don't know how many seasons we're gonna do, but you know, we're just gonna roll with it and see how it goes. So without further ado, let's jump right in. And Ramon scores on the RBI single. He's got more hits this week than Kendrick Lamar. I am going to be transparent with you guys. I've never played this game before. I've played lots of MLB The Show, and listen, I'm kind of a video game nerd. It all started when I got my very first Game Boy Color. And after that, the rest was history. I got a PlayStation 2 for Christmas. I played Kingdom Hearts, and I played Spyro, and I played all of the Super Mario games, and I played all the Harry Po- Listen, I'm not gonna get into it, okay? I love video games, and I always have. I love Pokemon, all of the things. So for me, this is a dream come true video games, specifically simulation games, and baseball. All in one. It's a beautiful thing. Let's take a look at our inbox really quick. We have a, a little email from Arturo Moreno with new goals. He says, Swilly, welcome to the Los Angeles Angels organization. Thank you for having me. I trust that our working relation will be a good one. I will submit some new goals each year that I would like to see you accomplish, as well as winning on the field and turning a profit. Completing these goals is the best way to keep me happy. The first part's a lie. So we're already starting off on the wrong foot. Second part's true. First part, I don't believe you. So here are the goals. Play close to 500 ball. Okay. Upgrade at first base. Okay. Acquire a Cy Young Award winner. Build a top six minor league system. Increase fan interest. Keep building your team up in order to reach the playoffs in the next four seasons. I know why this organization is failing. Because look at the goals. They're all over the place. Can't have your cake and eat it too, babe. That's not how it works. I will check in periodically throughout the year with your progress. Good luck, Arturo Moreno. Now listen, buddy. I know you would never admit it, but we're rebuilding this bad boy. That's just how it's, this is just how it has to be. We're not gonna be hitting all of those goals. I apologize for that. I do like that you have built a top six minor league system. That's sort of my plan going forward, but we're just gonna play out year one and kind of see what happens, see where the team is sitting, see who's available at the deadline, all that fun stuff. But before we meet the team, meet the staff, all of that stuff, there is one extremely important thing that I must do. Okay, all better. My goal moving into this year one of me being the GM of the Angels, I would like to clean up the bullpen a bit because I think we can do a little bit better. I would like to take a look at our coaching staff, see what we can upgrade there, and maybe take a look at some potential trades. But at the end of the day, I would like to keep the lineup pretty similar to what it is, see how we're doing around the trade deadline, and then make some really solid trade deadline moves. Again, the only goal that I'm paying attention to when it comes to Arturo Moreno is building that farm system because we gotta be a winning ball club at some point. And what we're doing right now, AKA not having a plan, is not working. So let's see what we can do about this pitching staff. I think we can make a few changes. I would really like to see what we can get for Jose Suarez because, well, he has the stuff but it just hasn't really panned out and that's okay. You're allowed to let go of players that just aren't really thriving in the organization. So I would like to see if I can shop this player around. Okay, so I got a few more trades, so we'll take a look. I kind of don't hate 
this first one. Yeah, I bet you would think long and hard before making this trade. Let's take a look at this one. We have some young pitchers here. Don't really need a shortstop. That's the only thing. Huh. I kind of like this top one, and I like the one with the Mariners. I mean, Rendon is probably going to get hurt, right? So, you know what? We're going to do it. Thank you so much. Oh, Jose Suarez is gone, which is a good start. <laughs> Let's see. What next? Let's set some lineups. Why is Sean Owellen right? That's the first issue that I have. Let's maybe not have Charles LeBlanc. Who do I have? I have Aaron Hicks. <sighs> okay, I guess so. I don't mind Luis Renjifo leading off. It's not the worst thing in the world. Mike Trout is going to hit second. I like Taylor Ward third, and I like Ohapi. Oh, hobby down here at fourth. Okay, I like that a little bit more. I think that works. And then versus a lefty, I'm probably gonna keep this pretty similar to be honest. He's a Gemini? That makes so much sense. So much sense. Injury proneness, fragile. That's an understatement. Where is Joe Waddell? Am I missing something? Like this is not all of my players, is it? Part of the fun in this is that I don't know what I'm doing. So we're just gonna see what happens. Also like, where's Mickey Moniak? Like where's the team? All right, I figured it out. We got Joe Adele up. I'm gonna put Hixie and then let's put Joe Adele here. Right field I think is good. Aaron Hicks in right field. I don't really wanna change the lineup too much to start. <laughs> don't understand why we're so obsessed with having Hoppy hit second. That is crazy to me. I don't mind him hitting fourth, but second is crazy. Okay, we'll run with that to start. It's the next day, which means I think my trade should have gone through. I'm taking a look at our scouting director as of now. I kind of want to see if I can change some of these based off of what he's best at. So scouting amateurs... It looks like we do have a good amount of money going to that, but maybe I can increase it a little bit. Let's see. Don't really care too much about major league scouting. Maybe a little bit more towards international. I don't really know if that makes a huge difference, but that's okay. Yeah, I'm going to take a look at our personnel really quick and see if we can make some changes. I would really like to relieve Mike Frost out of his duties. I really don't think that he is that great at his job, at least in real life. I would prefer to find somebody that is good at preventing arm injuries average isn't really great i mean back injuries legendary okay i guess if i fire them though what happens i guess we'll see what happens <laughs> okay i like somebody with a good reputation 23 years experience rick jameson what are you good oh hello hello i would sign a five-year contract for seven hundred and fifty thousand dollars per season Okay, that was a good choice on my part. See, I'm good at this. I'm good at this, okay? Hopefully he accepts my offer. I literally gave him what he wanted, so. All right, let's see anybody else. I don't really want Ray Montgomery as my bench coach. I'm gonna be really honest. You know what I just thought about? I do like Barry. That's the problem, but I would love to call up Michael Wirtz. He just in real life is so good. We'll see how Barry does for a year and then we'll maybe revisit because I really like Michael Wirtz. Okay, I'm done debating. So let's see what we can do. Uh, so we have Joe Girardi is going to be the first guy that I have. Any names that I recognize? I mean, hiring Joe Girardi could be something. <laughs> good at handling aging, which is great. I don't mind favoring on base percentage. I also don't mind favoring speed. You know what? Let's hire Joe Girardi. I'm not opposed. Ooh. it. I got another email from Artie. Welcome to the new season. I hope that off season treated you well. This is also a reminder that you should at least try to stay close to an even record. Shut up. I have to figure out how to get my traded guys onto this roster. How do I do it? Okay, I'm pretty sure that the players are on my DFA list. The only problem is where, oh, there it is. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and put Chase Silseth back in Rocket City, and then I'm gonna bring Gomber here. McMahon, we're gonna bring Adrian's. We're gonna wave you. Sorry, Bubba. 
Appreciate you though. There we go. Okay, so let's take a look at the lineups one more time and then I think I'll be able to sim to opening day. I made a few changes to the roster. I traded away a few players and we made some changes to the coaching staff. So I feel pretty good about where we're at. Let's just take one more look at the lineups and see what we're working with. I should add somebody to my starting rotation, eh? There we go. Oh, I got a new message. Yay, we hired our uh, our, our uh, Chingus, our guy, our new, um, our new team trainer. He accepted the offer. Yay, Joe Girardi's our new bench coach. I know people are screaming at me because of that, but you just have to trust me, okay? I know what I'm doing. I'm a Twitter GM, all right? Leave me alone. I just realized I have four lefties in my rotation. It's fine. And he's a really good looking young man with the perfect body right we have made it to opening day with the current roster that we have let's go ahead and get this first game of the season underway and that will conclude the first episode detmers versus burns we're not starting sandy on opening day because we have brains okay everybody hello who's hitting sixth <laughs> hello is this a glitch what is going on <laughs> Where's my sixth batter? <gasps> what? Okay, hold on. I need a DH. I thought Jury was supposed to DH. That's hilarious, actually. I almost went into that game without a sixth batter. I thought I put Jury there. Let's put Jury a DH. Let's get this show on the road. So, I think I'm gonna quick play the at bat because, well, we have places to go, baby. Here we go, everybody. Luis Renjifo. Oh, that's a double. That's a leadoff double to right center. Out of baby. Oh, oh, we're taking third. I'm sorry. Leadoff triple for Hefe? Let's go. Certainly, we score with a runner in scoring position and no outs, right? Certainly. Okay, listen guys, I'm built to be a GM of a team because what just happened is because of me. So we have our first run on the board. Taylor Ward is up to bat. I mean, oh, that's gonna be caught. All right, that's all right. That's a good piece. We have Logan O'Hoppy up to bat. A little ground out to third. That's all right, bud. And now we have Nolan Shawnowell up to bat. Base hit. Let's go! I thought he hit the pitcher. That was crazy. Brandon Jury up to bat. And he strikes out looking. Okay. I'll take a 2 nothing lead. All right, we have Reed Demers on the bump. First at bat. Now listen, if it was Sandy on the mound, I don't really know what to say. I'm just kidding, Sandy. I love you. That's a great play. Two outs, Adley Rutschman up to bat. And he walked him. I mean, one, two, three inning would just be too much to ask for. Oh, Trout, he laid out! Out of baby! Are you kidding me? Fire me up, Mike Trout. Joe Adele's first at bat of the season is a strikeout. Now we got Tony two bags. I was trying to speak it into existence, and that certainly didn't work, but that's okay. It's fine. Wayne hit me up. Was that a walk? Oh, we got hit. Of course he got hit. The lineup has turned over only in the second inning. We love to see it. Luis Renjifo up to bat. Screamer! Oh, that's a great grab! That was a great piece, Hefe. Don't change a thing, baby. All right, bottom of the second inning. A nice little fly out, right? No, that's a home run. The way the ball was going, I, th <laughs> I thought that was a lazy fly out. Whoa, what is happening over here? Are those supposed to be fireworks? That was crazy. At least it was just a solo shot. That's all right. Let's just get, it, get right back to it. That is an out. Beautiful way to bounce back. Jackson Holiday made the opening day roster and he struck out. Sounds about right. And two outs. Strike three. All right, that's all right. You know what? I'll take one run. That's fine. 
Let's just go get it back. Let's go get it back. Okay. All right. You know what? We're making contact with the ball, and I'm not upset about it. At least we're not striking out. This game is not realistic. We are not striking out nearly enough. Cedric Mullen, strike three. How did he not catch that? How about a little ground ball? Oh, I don't have words. Oh, he went to bunt and he missed it like a dingbat. Am I not? I'm clicking at bat. Are we joking? Are we? Okay, this, okay. You know what? I spoke too soon about this being not realistic enough. Now it's realistic. All right. I need a strikeout. Thank you. Maybe the game just listens to what I say. Ground ball? Okay, I'll take a strikeout. Well, that was fun. Here we go, Shana Well, Start us off. So that's what a lazy fly ball looks like. All right, Joe Adele, show me what you got. Okay. Okay, how do I do the bullpen? Huh. We're learning as we go. All right, Detmers. Can we make, oh, we made a play. Great job. We do know how to play baseball. Jackson Holiday, strike three. I'll take that. That's fine with me. And two out. Strike three. Okay, base hit. Oh, double. That's a, that's a double down the line for sure. Can we get rid of the ball? It's just a game. It's just a game. Okay. How about some soft contact? He was. That was the craziest catch I've ever seen in my entire life. Top of five. Let's get another run on the board. I don't like 2 1. That doesn't make me feel very good. Okay. Let's try again. Okay. A little Oppo Taco action out of Baby Netto. All right, Heafy. Stay hot up there. All right, Trouty. Stay hot up there. I really spoke too soon about this not being very realistic. Okay, Gunnar Henderson. Okay, we're at 74 pitches. Maybe we do put somebody else in here. Okay, let's go ahead. I don't really like any of these options, unfortunately. <laughs> I need to go find a lefty. That would have been helpful. Let's warm up Soriano and Matt Moore. Okay, here we go. Nice, efficient inning here. We need it. That's a great grab. Thank you for catching something that was hit right at you. Strike three. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. I don't know with this game if it's going to be a bomb or if it's a lazy can of corn. I'm just not sure. Oh, boy, this is going to be a hit, isn't it? All righty. Out of baby Detmers. Come on, Wardy. Base hit. Was that a drop through strike? <laughs> okay, I guess. All right, Logan O'Hoppy, show me what you got. Base hit. Oh, we're not gonna try to. Okay. I feel like. Never mind. I'm just not gonna say anything. Base hit. You got this. Yeah, this is very realistic now. 84 pitches. We'll go ahead and take it on a on an at bat basis. We'll see what we're working with here. Okay. How is that possible? All right, beautiful. Ah! 
mean, it's Jackson Holiday, right? What could go wrong? All right, I just need some soft contact. Get me out of this inning. Why are we holding on to the ball for five years? Okay, uh, let's go ahead and put Soriano in. Okay, what could go wrong here? Very good. I mean, we had to score more runs anyways, right? Joe Adele, show me what you got, Bubs. Let's go. Can we not look at strike three? Oh, we have a new pitcher in. Come on, Tony, two bags. Tony, Tony. Oh, get out, ball. Oh, get out, ball. Yeah, Tony. That's what I'm talking about. Neto, why not you? Well, that's a good piece. He fee, he fee, he fee. <laughs> Swinging butt, I guess. All right, bottom of the seventh. Oh, that was cute. They were playing take me out to the ball game. Oh, you oh you checked your swing. Okay, apparently. Why are we not throwing it? Why did we not throw it? Ah! Okay, everything's fine. All right, good job, you got an out. Wow, oh, you didn't tag on that? That's a little silly, but I'll take it. Just get me through this inning, pal. Good job. Okay, we need to score runs. Trouty? Way to start it off. That's my leader. Come on, Wardy. Oh, Hoppy's got your back. He's going to pick you up right here. I meant to say Sean Noel's going to pick you up. Oh, that's dropping. Oh, that's dropping. And Trouty moves to third? Let's go. All right, Drury. I need you right here, bud. Oh, oh, get down, ball. Oh, get down, ball. I need a one, two, three inning here, pal. Let's do this. Very good. Very good. One more. Beautiful. Maddie Moore, you're a dog, dude. Why are we jogging? Hello? Let's get some pep in our step, bud. There was a ball hit to center, and you let Cedric Mullins get a triple off of you. That's insane. I'm just going to be honest. That's pretty insane. All right, I need a run, folks. Joe Adele, show me what you got. Okay, very good. Who do I have up? Rendon? Tony's hot. We're fine. Tony's hot. Beautiful. I spoke way too soon when I said that this wasn't realistic enough. Wee! Oh, look! Everybody in our Division 1 except for us. I love it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know down below how you feel about this game, about this series. I would love to do more of this, maybe intermittently. So now that you have a taste of what it's like to watch an Angel game with me, bet you really enjoyed that. I love you guys so much. And remember to not let sports affect your mental health. Have a great rest of your day and I will see you soon. Bye.